Yo, you two, what's up? It's your boy Noah here with the World War One. I. I think it's World War One. I. I don't know. <laughs> it's World War One. Actually, no. Uh, the guy said I got this from. If you're wondering where the hat came from, I went to a flea market today and I. I got some stuff. I got. Let me see what I got. Uh, I got like a sword. I got some nunchucks. Right here. Oh, I got nunchucks here, real ones. Fuck. So, you know, I could just. You can't really. God damn, you can't really see it. See? Yeah, I'm not really good with nunchucks. So, um, I'm gonna train with them. Got trained ones I'm gonna use. So, anyways, um, that's not what I wanted to come here for. Well,. I want to show you the World War One hat because it's really cool. It's um, it, it has a. Where is the middle? I really did, should have got more prepared for this. I didn't. But that's my video. They don't fucking have. They don't make no goddamn sense in them. Oh, I heard that Tik YouTube is getting freaking more age restriction. I mean, wasn't it? I, I don't know. I'm not into that. Anyways, um, don't. I don't want to get banned for this. I'm doing a review of my Cold Steel bow kit. And I just gotta say, I love the sword. I really do like the sword. I like that. I like the weight, the weight of it. I like the feel of it. I mean, you already know who the fuck is. If you guys don't know who Cold Steel is, y'all know who Cold Steel is. It's like a big, it's a big company that makes knives but they also make swords and other melee weapons and shit yeah so um let's get into the measurements i have a ruler right here that i can use to measure it and here we go so okay in the sheath the blade length is about overall is 38 inches in the sheath but when you take out the sheath maybe it's going to be a different measurement let me measure it well i'm already i'll show you it's about and this is i sharpen this it's about oh no it's like three feet so around 35 inches if, if y'all can see that right here about oh fucking hell it's like a it's like a mirror yeah so it's about it's like, hold on, fuck. This is retarded. Okay. Yeah, it's about 30. It's 33 feet. It's 3 feet. And the blade is about, I want to say about 20 inch, or inch, I don't freaking know. Inches, feet, I think this is in inches. Yeah. Okay, no, it's like, it's 3 feet, but it's 35 inches. And the blade is about it's about two feet and twenty three inches. Twenty three inches and a quarter. Not, what the fuck do I do this? Um, right, right here. It's right here. See. And um, yeah, it's sharp. Let me just uh. It's not, is a hair shrewing chart? It's not, but it's like, let me find a piece of paper right now. Use this. Um, it's so sharp. I haven't cut it with it, but it, it will cut paper. Well, I, did you guys see it? Let me do it again. It will cut paper, and um, how is it to use? Here, let me demonstrate. It's all right. It's good. It it has a good weight to it. I like it. It's I don't know the steel that it's made out of. I want to say it's like uh, it's I don't really know how much of it's steel. Be honest, with you, I'm an amateur. I don't know. I don't. I just. I'm factually with sword. I'm a sword nerd. 
but I still don't know some things about it. You know, I'm still a novice at that, but I want to say it's like, does it say the still on here? It does not. Oh, no. It was made in South Africa. That's kind of interesting. Uh, Katana. I mean, it's a machete, but that's kind of weird that like, Katana was made in South Africa. I mean, I don't know. Not. Uh, usually, usually they say like, I don't know, like China or India. I never really thought. Of it. I mean, it is a machete, so. Yeah. That's true. I'm not. I don't fucking. I'm not saying that African, like, swordsmanship was just machete fighting. That's bullshit. That's a lie. They had sword fighting. It's just, it's just weird that Katana is made in South Africa. You'd think that the Katana would be made in Japan, but it's whatever. It's a good sword. It's a really good sword. Whatever it's made from, where it's made from. It's a good sword. It's a bang for your butt. I got this for, like, 30 30 bucks on Amazon, that's how much you can, I don't know how to put the links in the shit, I don't know how to do that, I'm not that big of a YouTuber, so I don't know that, but you know, just bang for your buck, you get what you get, if you want, it's a good backyard cutter, you can get it sharpened, really the best way to get it sharpened, I could, I suggest you get one of these bad boys, and you just put it across the blade, it's a knife sharpener. it works really good, or I was using this Smith, like, sharpener, no, that, and, um, yeah, you're good to go, it's good to cut, you, I mean, you're not really gonna fight with it, I mean, you could, but, I mean, don't do it, don't, I'm not saying fight, don't fucking go out and fight with these, don't, it's a good back, it's just for back here cutting, or if you're going camping, you know, for so you know, it could be used for self defense. No, it got you're in a. I'm not trying to say I'm not condoning violence, condoning violence. Fuck that. Don't go listen to me. I'm not. I'm an idiot, really. Um, yeah, it's like it's good. I mean, comparatively to an actual katana, it's short. Like I actually have one right here, which this is another one I got that you seen in my videos I cut with. My friend's Tori and shit. And I don't think I have one with my friend Jacob, me cutting. Um, but if you can see comparatively, this is about a couple, I don't know, it's like it has more reach than this for, for you're saying, like, it's just made up scenario that if you fight, if someone, if you're fighting against this, you still have an advantage. You can still, you know, you can still, you know, block and all that shit. But, you know, it's still, I mean, this is, if I had to choose which one I would want to use to, like, for self-defense, I would use this because you have more reach. But this one's still pretty good as well. Down. So, um, yeah, it's a pretty good sword. You know, I like it. Never really do any, I don't really do any reviews and shit on this channel. It's mostly just me sword fighting and stuff you know that's really all it is really quite frankly and it it's probably not gonna get that many views i know that i need to get more i don't know uh it's like do i want to be famous because then the drama youtube drama and shit that's a pain in the ass i don't really want that shit on me and i just want to make youtube to show my love i really like these sort i like talking about swords. that's my passion i like talking about like anime I wouldn't say anime. I'm not an anime. Well, I am, but I wouldn't say I'm your typical anime guy. I'm no, I'm not. I'm not trying to say, oh, I'm like the. I'm just. I'm old fashioned type of anime. I like Dragon Ball Z. I like. No, I don't hate Naruto. I know what Naruto is. I like. I did the Naruto run. The cool. What weird ass kid didn't do the Naruto run, quite frankly? I would you just call me a weeaboo? Uh, yeah, I guess you can call me a weeaboo. I. I live with my mom, I'm a virgin, you know, yeah, it's just, um, that's okay, I really don't care, I'm not hurting anybody, I'm not trying to start shit with anybody, I'm just trying to have fun, you know, I'm trying to have a good time, you know, just have fun, you know, practice sword fighting, talk to girls or guys, whatever you like, you know, just, I'm here to have a good time, quite frankly. No, I'm just, 
Um, here I'm ranting. It was supposed to be a review. And I'll still call it a review. You get the good, uh, you get the good nitpicks and shit. Um, yeah, so, I'm gonna hang it up. I'll talk to you guys later. May the force be with you and be safe. Bye.